How's it going, everyone? I'm Just Loving Dave, and welcome back aboard the Nostalgia Train. Okay, so this is technically take two, admittedly, and this is going to be my last attempt of a take. Um, it's because there are cutscenes near the end of this, like two episodes ago, I took an attempt and there were way too many cutscenes to do so. Um, the ending cutscenes, I'm going to have to start a little bit before they happen. Or stop a little bit before that. So this will either be a little bit shorter of an episode, or something like that. It, which should be fine. Anyway, let's watch the Chapter 5 opening. I just wanted to lose consciousness. The deepest part of my brain had become thoroughly clouded over. And there were moments when I felt as though I could almost slip away. What? But the intense pain would always wrench me back to my senses before I could follow through. Is this Ayumi talking? I would have welcomed even a momentary loss of consciousness with open arms. But any sort of respite from my suffering was plainly denied me. The only possible escape was death, and death was certainly at hand, but it was taking an eternity to reach me. I was like a shellfish removed from its shell. I knew my fate, but only the chef could make the end come, and she was savoring my torment. Yeah, okay, this is definitely a Yumi talking. All right. Hi. Psycho... Sachiko? She's about to turn your eye to gush, Ayumi. If I remember correctly from last episode. Ugh. It's a lot of blood at once. I mean, it makes sense. If I remember last time, basically, she stabs the eye until it's soup. The third victim was stabbed in the left eye an indeterminate number of times. Which is what's happening right now. I'd assume. Because Yuki was the third victim. Until our eyeball became soup like. Yep. In consistency. She was eventually just left for dead. <laughs> You're a tenacious one, aren't you? Yep. Honestly, if she was doing this, I would have spit in her face. I wouldn't have screamed, stop it. I would have spit in her face for that. It'd all be over if you just die already, you know? Well, I mean, this one was very persistent. <laughs> oh. There. Now that it's nice and mushy, let's see if we can scoop it out. Oh. So that's the one time you're actually willing to do the symbols instead of the actual word. That is the one time. Wow. Okay, moving on. Strangely, it was only after these mutilations where, oh gosh. It's going too fast for me to be able to read it. You pause it if you want, but there's no way I'm reading that. Hmm. Now open up and say, ah. Ah. Not that kind of ah. Trust me. <laughs> oh, mommy. <laughs> oh, mama. Yeah, you're getting it entirely wrong. Try screaming for your life while getting your tongue cut off. Yeah, that's what's going on. Well, actually, 
actually, let's put it this way. What I just experienced, if, I, if I'm correct, is an eyeball getting stabbed to the point where it's like soup, and then a tongue getting cut off of the same person. Ah, oh, jeez, this again. My, you're really shaking. What's the matter? Why would I want to tell you? No! No! <laughs> okay. You know what? We're just gonna... What? You really are shaking. Um, may I ask what, what your sister is like? Oh, certainly. She's a very cute little girl. Quite small, but with great big eyes. You're describing... her. Uh, I see. Her hair is short, and she's in junior high school. Yeah, he's definitely describing Yuka. As I recall, she was always wearing a blue smock. Yeah, he's definitely describing her. Huh? What? I saw that smile. <laughs> I don't even know how to make that sound. It sounds like he's about to fart. I know that's not what's happening, but still. Um, I, 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 I think I'll be okay on my own. I'll look for my big brother by myself. Th th thank you. What are you saying, Yuka? I am your big brother. Oh. No. Oh, that does not look nice. That menacing turn? Stay away from me. You're my little sister. I'm not. And there's simply no way out of here. Everyone is going to die. So let's continue to be brother and sister until our dying breaths. For however long we may have. Uh, um, goodbye! Yuka, -chan. Yuka, I wouldn't recommend going that way. Something dreadful happened downstairs just a moment ago. If I remember correctly, you basically just a moment ago, in other words, a few episodes ago, killed your best friend. Huh? <laughs> Technically, that happened here, but, you know, you got shoved to the floor below. Nope, 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 move, 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 go, 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 go. Stay as far away from me as possible. Yep, that's what I thought. <laughs> okay. Um... Are you all right? <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> My name is Moshida. Um, your stomach is bleeding really bad. I'll try to find something to stop it. <laughs> My handkerchief won't help for a wound this big. Come on, Yuka. Think. Think. I see you. You can't, but I can. Ah, oh, you, you need to, you, you, you need to get, get away from here. Right now. Hurry. But, but, if I don't do something about your injuries, you're gonna die. I'll just uh, apply pressure, okay? Stay with me. No, please, just go! And hi. Hiro 
Kawasaki. Who on earth could have done this to you? I am going to give you a menacing death glare until the end of time if I have to for that statement. Okay, no I'm not, because you'll probably kill me before I can. Uh-oh. What the f- That's for not listening to your big brother, Yuka. You are not that. Did she just throw up? <laughs> She's going into convulsions. How ghastly. Yep. Zami, stop this. So, I guess for those who don't know, convulsions are basically, it's a mix of when you're having a seizure, but to the point where you're starting to throw up because of it. Zami! I mean, I didn't need to say that, but, you know. Kazami, I'm sorry. Huh? Pardon? Thank you for distracting him. I should have done more to stop you. When we were kids. I'm your best friend, after all. But I never filled that role very well. I never did the things I should have. What are you going on about? You really deluded yourself into thinking you're my best friend. Maybe? I don't recall you ever standing up for me. Not even one time. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I guess I really haven't been a very good friend. Well, you won't be regretting that for long. But I must say, I am rather curious about these things you should have done as my so-called best friend. Please, do enlighten me. Oh, I don't know. Maybe something like this? <laughs> he kind of deserved that. You should have shoved him down the hole behind him, though. Oh, that is a strong push to have to do. Ugh, that really hurt, you know. Yeah, you wouldn't. You didn't see what happened. Stop blaming other people for everything, you fucking coward! <coughs> you son of a bitch! Uh-oh. Take a good look around you, Kazami. Take a good look at who you're up against. No one is conspiring against you. We're no threat. We're your friends. <laughs> That's bullshit, and you know it. You're a fucking coward, Kurosaki. Uh-oh. Oh, this is not going to end well. Not looking. Not looking. In case it wasn't heard, I'm not looking. Kinda. Okay, I guess I have to. Ugh. I mean, she kind of already did that, but still. Okay, good, I don't have to look anyway. My stomach, it really hurts. Big front hurts. This is not going to end well for me, is it? Back to your senses, are you, Yuka? Okay, I'm glad I didn't watch that. Ugh. Everything is just fine now. Your big brother will protect you. Your big, strong brother will make sure to keep you safe. Nope. No thanks. Uh-uh. Precisely, exactly that. What did you just do? What's this? Key. Science lab, it says. 
Guess you won't be needing this anymore, Kurosaki. Um... I should have let that run. Isn't it just horrible? The way these spirits kill people? You wouldn't want that to happen to you. Right. No, but I'd prefer that over you killing me. Well, don't worry. I won't let them. No. I'll protect you from that horrible fate. And you'll kill me instead? So you see, I'll put an end to it myself. Yep, called it. I'll snuff out that tiny, tiny life of yours. Um... Big Brother! Okay, so there are two ways to go about this. I... Shut up and let me tell... Okay. Come on, no fair running! He said something else, but I missed it. Okay, before moving on, I'm going to point out there are technically two outcomes to this. I found this out by looking at the guide earlier, but this was in the failed recording that I did. You can either let him catch you, and you'll still move on in the story anyway, but you'll lose two trophies, which I've already got because of that long run. Or you can let him chase you, and you can run from it and succeed. We are going to do that. Oh, man. Okay, never mind. Ay! Oh, that does not look good. That does not look fun. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to kill you, Yuka. Uh, no, you're not. Nope, because I'm going down. Oh. <laughs> I got so lucky there. Oh my gosh, I got so lucky. Come here. Come at me, bruh. Ha! Ah, I am so lucky. I'm not that, that, wow. Now I know exactly where to go. It's basically a go back and forth kind of thing. So up here. You go. Shut up! In here. It's actually a simple one. It's not that bad. Okay, I'm like looking for a place to go. That would be here. Just keep going right. Just keep going right. Until you can't go right no more. Which I think is here, actually. Yep, go north. Oh, no, 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 don't. Never mind. Go south. Go south. Go south. <laughs> Ah, uh, yep, go south. Hey, shut it! Go to the left. And into this area. I think I'm running from him. I'm running as far away as possible. And if he's... If he was... Come out, come out, wherever you are! This is the area where you keep going right. Ow! Oh, that looks like it hurt. Be a good girl, Yuka, and come with me. No! And then a repeat. Okay, so basically the rest of this is a repeat of what I just read. So I'm gonna ignore it and run for my damn life. It's the key to the front entrance. Take it. Yes! The funny thing is, he's still gonna follow me out this door. I don't know where that comes from, but he does. I know you're going to kill me. You really, really want to. No! I am not going to be a good girl. You're screwing up for Jamie's out of this mid score. Shut it! All right, so go north. This is basically all we got to do now is backtrack and unlock that door. I don't think we've seen saying it's locked yet. Maybe we have. I don't remember. I legitimately don't remember. Shut up. Oh, gosh, he's going faster. He's getting faster. You right, huh? 
Okay. Oh, crap. I think I need to go downstairs. Down, down, downstairs we go. No! 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 No, no, no. I'm not complying. Yes. Oh, for the love of shut up. I get it. You want to kill me. You want to kill me. You get satisfaction on off of it. How you do, I don't understand. Get the front door's locked. Not anymore, it's not. Get me out of here. Run, 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 run. Okay. Ugh. Yeah, that. No! Hi. This way. Hurry. Well, she wants me to go in there, but... I'm just pausing so he can't catch up to me. We'll save that for next time. I'm going to leave this video here. So, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. Episode? What the heck is an episode? Episode of Corpse Party. Um, we'll follow her down into that entrance area or whatever's down there next time. But for right now, as I said, I'm going to leave this video here. Thanks for watching this episode. If you liked it, make sure to push that like button. And so far, you can't sit it anymore. And I'm aware I went in a loop. I'm sorry. Um, if, you re uh, if you really like this video, though, consider subscribing to the channel. Um, if you have a suggestion for an indie horror game or an indie game or just a horror game, any of the categories, let us know in the comments below. Want to check out another RPG horror game that has been like this that has been done prior to this? Click the link in the bottom right corner of the train to take you to that destination. Or if you missed any of the stops on this right, click the link across right here and the train to take you there. In the meantime, this train's off to its next destination, but we hope to catch you guys in another ride. Bye!